Hi, this is Cash from datatechnologyllc.com. Welcome back to another part in the series on how to make money and get paid online uh, the right way using Google AdSense. Like I mentioned, uh, this is part three. Uh, it has been uh, basically like two weeks uh, since we went over the last one. Uh, just been uh, occupied with some other uh, projects and whatnot so I did not get a chance to put this thing together so let us uh, do a little bit of recap before we jump into today's topic um, essentially you need to find a profitable area where you can uh, make money online uh, ideally it needs to be something that you are uh, maybe interested in or you know you have some expertise in we are basically um, you know focusing on car insurance uh, as we like to make cash uh, and we had showed you earlier in part one I believe that if you go to google to google.com slash adwords and uh, utilize their keyword tool the uh, the car insurance uh, CPC which is the cost per click is quite high uh, you know so we are trying to um, take advantage of that situation and basically uh, come up with a site, create some content, throw some ads on there and then you know wait for some traffic okay so uh, that was the first step the second one obviously is to uh, register uh, a domain if you can uh, you know come up with a cool domain that sounds good not only sounds good but has the keyword phrase uh, in it uh, you know that would be great uh, remember that we are trying to optimize for the term car insurance okay uh, so you know following along those lines we had basically uh, registered www.mycar-insurance.net uh, the site is still in the works uh, the next thing we talked about was essentially uh, you know the design and in case you have forgotten this I think I do have this layout real quickly uh, you know a good uh, navigational layout that seems to work fairly good is to you know have uh, sort of like a top navigation bar uh, you know home uh, home page or a link for home page contact us some kind of logo and whatnot uh, you know you could uh, throw throw an animation right over here if you wanted to then you're gonna have a left navigation bar which uh, will you know primarily help the user find their way around your website um, uh, one of the more important areas not only for search engine optimization but for also for users is essentially you know the middle uh, this is where users are gonna get you know focus their attention uh, you know as they're used to seeing uh, top and left navigation bar so you know they're gonna want to go straight to the content obviously you know you can have Google Ads on the right side and then I also recommend having a footer on the bottom okay so just a, a little bit about the layout um, I will just leave this up and running uh, today uh, essentially we are going to focus on content uh, we had just uh, started talking about this uh, in our last session there are really uh, two schools of thought on this you can either create your own content if you have half a decent uh, writing skills um, you know this is obviously um, a cost-effective way and there's a lot of research online uh, especially on a topic like car insurance so all you really need to do is find some time you know go out there uh, get some research done on your own don't uh, copy and paste content uh, you know that will not get you anywhere uh, do some research Put it in your own words uh, you know so that is one way to do it and uh, this is primarily what we're going to cover um, we have already written the article so we're not gonna you know bore you to death but uh, you know we we tend to write our articles in word then we copy it to notepad to kind of take out all the formatting that microsoft word generates and then finally we copy it to uh, some sort of html editor obviously uh, you know you can go straight to the html editor um, we have found uh, just a few quirks when working with our HTML editor, so I prefer to kind of go through this three-step process. Um, so that's uh, one way to do things. The other one is obviously to you know hire someone to write content for you. There are a lot of uh, article writers out there. Um, some sites like uh, you know 
guru.com and whatnot so you know maybe we'll come back to this and uh, you know cover that in a little bit and then uh, if you want to look uh, what's coming down the pike we can uh, we will be talking about Google AdSense obviously how to set it up how to get the ads going and whatnot if you're new to this and then uh, we will revisit the content and optimize that for a search engine perspective um, by the way uh, this is our website uh, data technology llc.com uh, you know feel free to check it out we do have some tips and tricks on search engine optimization and just FII we are doing a partnership with Google and we are offering a hundred dollars off for Google AdWords this is the program that you can sign up to uh, essentially you know display your ads so keep that in mind uh, in enough talk let me switch gears here and move on to Microsoft Word here's an article uh, before I do that I apologize let me go back to our site uh, this is our site on uh, you know mycar-insurance.net it's still in the works uh, there's a lot of uh, uh, loose uh, pieces and parts if you will but today what we are going to focus in is under insurance resources we have sort of like a parent page uh, that talks about insurance coverage okay as you may know inf insurance coverage is broken down into liability comp collision and whatnot but uh, I'm uh, really focusing on this one page today okay and first thing you should notice is that you know since this page is talking about insurance coverage it's it's a good idea from a SEO point of view to just go ahead and name that uh, in line with your keywords okay um, I went ahead and already uh, sort of created the layout um, you know this this content on top uh, was you know basically set up initially when we had our uh, website designer put this together for us uh, what I've done since then is put in put in this table and broken this down into areas so anywhere it says you know enter tax this is where the main tax is gonna go and then notice I actually created two sections uh, here's where the Google Ads gonna go and I actually specified 336 uh, this if you don't know is 336 pixels Google has different ads like this ad on the right that you see is a hundred sixty actually by 600 I think initially we may have been doing 90 so anyway I put a section for Google Ads here uh, there's gonna be more text blah 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 and then again you know there's gonna be a section for another Google ad down here uh, some more text related links and whatnot by the way if you don't uh, know how I came up with this sort of layout you use uh, essentially tables they seem to work great for the web um, so I would highly recommend doing that so that is our page on the web right now I'm going to switch to word okay copy all of this um, before I do that let me just show you that you know we start out with in insurance coverage we say hey basically there are four types of insurance coverages when it comes to car insurance uh, you know we, we uh, put a heading there we talk a little bit about it um, you know use a lot of keyword phrases in here um, and we will you know definitely hammer that point later on in the game we have a link here that talks about essentially you know different states that uh, have coverages so that is our first coverage then we talk about comp collision which is you know when your car gets banged up in an accident you definitely need that um, we move on to auto medical payments and no fault insurance and then finally you know we talk about uninsured and underinsured motorists in case some jackass uh, you know rams their truck into your nice new car uh, you will be covered for that scenario and then we have related links which we don't have any links so we will have to work on that at some point uh, let's go ahead and copy this alright and I'm just actually going to go ahead and start closing some of these things so we can get rid of some of this clutter we got going on here plus my machine seems to die every now and then I got too much going on it just up with my brain activity level unfortunately um, alright so we are in here back to notepad I'm going to go ahead and create another um, 
blank notepad document I'm going to go ahead and paste this information and the reason I'm doing this is to get rid of all the formatting if you copy from let's say Microsoft Word to straight to an HTML editor uh, you may have noticed that you know Microsoft generates a lot of crap with all their tags okay so I prefer to take things to notepad and then from here I will uh, switch to my editor by the way if you don't know uh, this editor is called coffee cup HTML editor maybe I can uh, give them a plug real quick also if not if I have not mentioned today is June 7 okay a uh, few days I will have my birthday definitely a Gemini and more than one cents coffee cup HTML I think it's supposed to be one word but let's find out okay here it is okay so this is uh, definitely not a bad tool you can get this uh, you know the base product for free if you do not have an HTML editor um, you can download and whatnot so keep that in mind so switching back to our HTML editor and here is our page I'm going to go ahead and really uh, <clears throat> where it says enter text I will p go ahead and paste the whole the whole document okay and we will just kinda uh, you know work with pieces of it and move move them in separate areas okay so uh, that's obviously our title um, and then we say basically there are four types of insurances and you can another, do another thing that I definitely recommend is to you know make a list okay uh, what this does is that it sort of gives the user uh, you know better readability okay uh, what that means is that uh, you know they're not gonna totally get lost when they are looking at your document okay so I, I gave them that and then what I did is uh, I'm gonna give this one you know and you may have a different way of doing things too I just like to do uh, a lot of repetition um, the users can see that and also by the way it's important for SEO purposes you know that we will talk about very uh, important topic you know thank you for watching the sample video